Are you sure traveling through time is a good idea, Tony? Good idea? No. Necessary? Yes. Now excuse me while I make history. Jarvis, prepare the time jump protocol. Right away, sir. If you don't make it back, can I have one of your cars? Uh, no. Jarvis, activate the time jump. Time set to June 12th, 2017. Launching in three, two, one. All done. Wow, that was quick. What'd you change? It's simple. I went back in time to become the very first subscriber of Newscape Pro. What? That means you're the real OG. Wow, send me next. Sorry, big guy. Maybe next time. Your power will be mine, but to utilize it, I first have to siphon it. Jules! That's her? What is she strapped to? I don't know, but we have to help her. <sighs> Do not worry, Stark. I will accomplish what you cannot, and you will be memorialized as the first stepping stone to my victory. You sure about that? Huh? I see him, RP. Hold on! I have you now. Uh, I'll try spinning. That's a good trick. Whoa, whoa. Uh, uh. Uh. Now, fire! Uh. We got him, RP! Hooray! Oh, yeah! Go, Ray! Oh, yeah! Go, 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 go Ray! Go, go, go. Hmm. What's all that racket? Kids, what are you doing in here? Oh, hey, Paul. Happy and I were just watching a movie. Mr. Stark has a huge collection of action and superhero movies. He told us to watch them all for inspiration. Inspiration for what? Well, since we're both honorary Avengers, we gotta learn from the very best. Honorary Avengers, huh? Yep. It's an elite group, and we're strong and skilled enough to be a part of it. I'm sure Mr. Stark has invited you too, right, Papa? Uh, well, not with words, no. Oh, <laughs> sorry then, Paul. We really shouldn't be talking with you about this then. Oh, that's right. It's top secret stuff. You need high clearance levels. You both know I was the number two in an actual spy agency, right? <laughs> Number two. <laughs> uh, enjoy your movies, kids. <laughs> <laughs> As if I cared about not being an Avenger. I've been in plenty of exclusive groups before. There's Ghost and Ego and... Well, I guess those two are kind of the same group, but still. Ah, here we go. Jules is like me. She doesn't need to be part of some dumb group. Hey, Jules. Oh, hey, Meowsles. What's up? Nothing much. Just doing my rounds. What you working on there? Oh, this? Well, I figure since I'm an honorary Avenger now, I should have a cool mode of transportation. Just as a backup, Ohm. Sheesh, touchy. Wait, you're an honorary Avenger too? That's right. After I beat Dr. Doom, Tony made me one. I guess it's a pretty big deal, but I'm sure you know that already. You're one too, right? No, but Kit and Happy are. Hmm. Well, I guess that makes sense. They kind of have, like, super robot strength or whatever, whereas you're more just... normal. Me? Normal? I don't think so. Yeah, maybe that was a poor choice of words. Either way, sorry you're not an honorary member, Meowsles. I can talk to Tony for you if you'd like. Nah, I don't want to be in your exclusive little club anyway. Well, in that case, you want to help me name my car here? 
I've got a few options. What do you think about the Jules Mobile? Um, next? Golden Child? Nuh uh. 24 Car It? You know, because it's gold and also a car. Don't quit your day job, Jules. Okay then, what do you got, smart guy? How about Marigold 2? After your dad's old yacht. You mean the yacht that he named after me? Great suggestion, Meowsles. You know, I honestly forgot that you changed your name. <sighs> I guess for now we'll just go with TBD. Hmm. Or maybe Tibida. You know, I actually like the sound of that for some reason. Whatever floats your boat, Jules. Can you stop mentioning boats, please? I've got a lot of painful memories involving them. Sorry, sorry. I'll let you get back to working on TBD there. See ya, Meowsles. Is everyone an honorary Avenger but me? And that will improve your energy efficiency by 15.34%. Huh? Is that tech? Brilliant work, tech. As always. Thank you, Mr. Stark, sir. Just Tony's fine for you, bud. Hey, cool. Bud, right back at you. Wait, you want me to call you Tony too? No, no, no. Sorry, sir. Uh, I mean, Tony. Tech? What are you doing here? Oh, howdy, meowsles. I was just helping Tony with some tips and tricks. That's right, and I couldn't have asked for a better number two. His research into portal tech was instrumental to getting Stark Industries here in the first place, which is why I'm happy to call him an honorary Avenger. What? You, you really mean it, Tony? I sure do, sport. Welcome to the team. Woohoo! Look at me now, Mom. Your boy's an Avenger. Honorary Avenger. Right, right. Same difference though, sorta. Sorta, but not really. Congrats, Tech. But do you mind leaving me and Tony alone for a minute? We got some business to discuss. Oh, sure thing. I can't wait to go tell Penny. Weird, weird man. Talented, though. That's one thing we agree on, at least. So what can I do for you, Lionel? Well, it seems like you're making everyone in our group into an honorary Avenger and... Well... And you feel left out, right? No, not at all! I just find it strange that I'm being left out after all the help I've been. <sighs> Look, Whiskers, it's nothing personal. It's just... you're not really Avengers material. Come on now. I'm the one who brought Jen here, and I helped rescue Jules. Tell you what, if you can beat me in a fight, I'll let you into the club. What do you say? I say bring it on. Then on it is. I've been waiting for this. That makes two of us. You sure about this, grumpy cat? You can still back down. Not on your life. All right, you asked for it. Gotta warn you though, Stark Tech, it packs some serious firepower. These are the only guns I need to take you down, Tony. Then let's do this. Bring it! What is going on here? Jen? Shulky? You both realize that we're all on the same team, don't you? I do, but he doesn't. Tony, what does he mean by that? Ugh, he's just bummed because I wouldn't let him be an honorary Avenger, which, by the way, is a completely meaningless title. Well, if it's so meaningless, then why not give him it? Yeah! Fine, fine. Welcome to the team, Yassels. But just for the record, I would have kicked your butt. Not if I kicked yours first. You're both morons. That was a little harsh. And factually untrue. In my case, anyway. Shut up, Tony. 